Hi YouTube, Tim Unkert from UnkertEducation.com here. In today's video, we're going to install the Lapsy Editor as a flat pack on a Chromebook. The first thing we need to do is enable the Linux development environment. I'm going to click on the launcher here and go to my settings. And on the left hand of my settings, I'm going to go down to the Advanced tab and click to expand that tab. Inside that tab, the developers will open up, and if I click on that, I'll see I get Linux development environment. I'm going to turn that on, and a wizard's going to pop up that's going to walk me through the installation. I'm going to click Next. It's going to give me a username. I believe this is based off of your Gmail. Uh, you can change this during this setup. You can also change the disk size at any time. Okay, so uh, username you know pick one that you want to stick with disk size matters less I'm gonna go with both the username they gave me and the recommended size and click install that's gonna take a few moments so I'll come on back once that's done okay once that installs a terminal will pop up I'm going to expand this and I'll increase the font size so you can see the commands that I'm going to type so I want to make sure everything is up to date so I'm gonna type sudo apt get Date and sudo apt get dist dash upgrade and do a dash y flag and hit enter. Okay, once the Linux development environment is enabled, I can do control L to clear the stuff out and then I can type sudo apt install flat pack and hit enter. I'll confirm the extra space with a y and enter. And now that Flatpak is installed, I want to add the FlatHub repository. So let me open up a browser here. And I am going to look at this flatpak.org slash setup slash chrome percent uh, 20 OS. Okay. And I'm going to copy this command. So right here. So let me copy that and paste that into my terminal and hit enter and now I'm going to do control D to shut down the terminal and I'm going to shut down Linux here by right clicking and clicking shut down Linux I'll then start it back up and this will make sure everything is updated okay now that the Linux development environment is enabled Flatpak is installed and the FlatHub repository is enabled we can install Lapsy so I just went to flathub.org and searched for Lapsy, and this is what came up. And if I scroll down to the bottom of this page, I see how to install it via the command terminal. So it's flatpak install flathub dev.lapsy.lapsy. I'm going to just copy this line right here, and I'm going to paste with Control shift v and hit Enter. And it's going to ask me to proceed with these changes. I'm going to do Y and Enter. Okay. It says the installation is complete. Now to run this the first time, I'm going to copy this line here, flatpak run dev.lapsy.lapsy, and paste this into my terminal. And here we go. Lapsy opens up. I can expand it. Uh, if I look in my launcher, I see that I have an icon here. So let me right click and pin this to the shelf here. And now if I close this out and run it, I get Lapsy open. So we have a terminal here and we can get editing. Pretty cool modern editor. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. Thank you.